Hello everybody and welcome to a DaVinci Resolve tutorial. Uh, today I will be showing you my personal render settings for what I use to export music videos to send to clients over WeTransfer. So what that means is that the file has to be under 2 gigabytes. So you don't want to use any of these Vimeo, Twitter, 1080p, master things. You want to go over to custom and you're going to browse and choose your file name. Uh, mine's going to be tutorial render. Save. Uh, first thing you're going to do is change it, the format from QuickTime to MP4 and make sure this is on H.264. Uh, H.265 files are extremely large and not a lot of computers can handle them right now. Um, I always use NVIDIA because I have an NVIDIA graphics card. Um, if I don't, I usually run into GPU errors, uh, like GPU memory full. So if you're running into GPU memory full errors, try and switch this to NVIDIA. Um, Obviously, 4K, because I want to render in the highest quality possible. Uh, for YouTube, because YouTube uses two uh, different codecs when you upload to their site. And you want to use, if you upload anything higher than 1440p, it'll automatically force that codec and have better quality. So if you upload in 1080p, the chances are you'll have this um, digital noise on your video, because they will upload it in a lower quality, because it's 1080p. Um... And then I always use automatic best. If it's a three minute or less video, automatic best puts my video at about 1.8 gigs or so. Uh, it never goes over two gigabytes if it's less than three minutes. Um, sometimes I have to restrict to 120,000 if the video is longer than three minutes. I always use automatic best when I can though. I leave everything else how it should be and, and I don't change anything else. Um, and I have what I would say is pretty decent quality um, uh, compared to a lot of music videos that people render uh, in After Effects in Premiere. I noticed when I would render in Premiere, I would get all this noise um, every time I'd upload to YouTube. But now that I use these settings in DaVinci Resolve, I don't have any issues. Um, from now on, every single Thursday, I'll be dropping a tutorial. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description to all of my music videos that I've previously shot and edited. If you see any effects in there that you would like to be um, shown in a tutorial, uh, just leave it in the comment section of this video. And uh, that's about it. So thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe.